Hello everyone, welcome to unit number 10. Ilbon. We usually take clean drinking water for granted, but there are concerns that shortages of fresh water, or water that does not contain salt, will become major problems in coming years. So we're going to look at there are concerns that. All right, there are concerns Use there are concerns that to introduce a problem that is occurring or might occur that many people or the general public are worried about. So when you're concerned, it's kuminata, right? You're um, a little bit, it's also similar to worrying, like gokchongata. So there are concerns, kuminata. Example, there are concerns that Businesses are paying too little attention to cyber security. Kiobduri cyber boane normo shingyongul suji anko itanen yoryoga itta. These days everything is online, but the most important thing is cyber security. So some businesses they're not paying a lot of attention to cyber security, which is concerning to their workers. Another example B. The team's star player is injured and among fans, there are concerns that he may not be able to play this season. So, example like, 최고의 성수가, he received an injury. 그래서 팬들은 많이 고민합니다. 아마 제 팀 실패할 것 같아요, 이 season. So, they are very worried that, fans are very worried that this player might not be able to play all season, therefore their team will suffer. Another example, there are concerns that he might quit. Maybe he looks like he wants to quit, maybe he's not happy at the company. So some people are concerned that he might quit. Ibon. They are already a serious problem in some parts of the world, and climate change threatens to make things worse. Use threaten to with a base verb to express that something creates or increases the risk of an unwanted happening. We help hada. Okay, threaten to. To threaten someone is we help hada. So, example, large chains threaten to push small local shops out of business. 대경 사업 제도는 작은 지역 삼촌들을 폐업시키겠다고 위협하고 있다. These small local shops, like let's say cafes, are very worried that maybe Starbucks is going to take their business because Starbucks is a large chain, right? Starbucks is threatening small cafes or Cayenne cafes to lose a lot of money. B. Poor diet threatens to damage health of younger generations. So a poor diet is like konkang haji annen diet. The younger generation might suffer because their diet is not good. Maybe they eat um, snacks all the time. Yes, this is not good and it threatens to damage their health for the younger de generations. And as they get older, they might have more health problems. Another example might be, if he doesn't get a pay rise, he'll threaten to quit. Okay, if he doesn't get a pay rise, he'll threaten to quit. 그는 봉급이 오르지 않으면 그만두겠다고 위협할 것이다. He wants the pay rise. If he doesn't get one, he will quit. This is his threat. 위협하다. So now let's look at the language focus quiz. There are concerns that hmm will hmm this year. Uh, there are concerns that gas prices will go up this year, which is probably going to happen, right? Ore kirim kapsi orul So many people are worrying about this, especially if you have a car. There are concerns that not enough is being done about. Um, there are concerns that nothing... There are concerns that nothing is being done about... 
climate change. So climate change is really bad and many people are worried. Sambon. Hmm, threatens to uh, hmm, ruin hmm. pollution threatens to ruin the world. So pollution is very bad and it could make the world worse. Sabon hmm, threatens to make it a lot harder. My boss threatens to make it a lot harder to work. Maybe my boss is very mean. Maybe my boss is uh, not very nice. So they're threatening to make it harder for me to work. So now let's look at the further discussions. Do you use some sort of filtering device for the water you drink? Do you just drink it straight out of the tap or do you buy drinking water? I use a Brita filter. It's very useful and it cleans my water and I love using it every day. In Australia, we drink out of the tap but in Korea, I need to use a Brita filter. In addition to climate change, what threats do industry and agriculture pose to our freshwater supplies? People polluting, like I mentioned before. Uh, when there's a lot of pollution, it threatens our agriculture and our freshwater supplies. So you shouldn't, um, yes, you shouldn't pollute. You shouldn't litter. Okay, so that wraps it up for unit number 10. Please review everything, including the vocabulary, and also review what we've gone through today. I will see you on the next unit, and I will see you next time. Take something for granted. Take something for granted. Potable. Potable. Accessible. Accessible. Desalination. Desalination. Pathogen. Pathogen. Promising. Promising.